G'day, it's Robbie again. Well, I'm turning down a, uh, a drag link that came off the old uh, truck and there's some good steel in that. And while I was doing it, I suddenly thought, oh, this would be a good opportunity to show you how well this chip uh, deflector or chip catcher, I suppose you could say, tray works on the lathe. I mean, this lathe, when it came, had had no chip scrapers at all, but the problem is that chip scrapers really they only do part of a job, really. You really want to keep the crap off of the ways to begin with. So I'll just run a bit of footage showing you how well it works while I'm turning this uh, this old uh, drag link down. And uh, yeah, I think they're a great thing. Saves your ways, does a fantastic job, I think. So I'll fire up the old girl and uh, we'll see how she goes. Here's a look at it without all the crap on it with a three jaw scroll chuck. That's a five inch. The other uh, chuck I'm using is, uh, for the job is a, is a, a six inch four jaw. But either way, there's plenty of clearance. The plate doesn't come up right against the headstock, it pulls up a bit short. And as you can see, the carriage stop slides underneath it. So, plenty of clearance. And it's just held on by two Allen headed bolts that uh, would normally be used for the travelling steady. If I have to use the travelling steady, well, I just take the plate off, but that's not very often. And generally, clearance isn't an issue, even with the big uh, four jaw chuck. Um, most of the time, uh, it clears it for the jobs that I'm working on. If it won't, well, I just take it off. This is forged steel, so uh, I'm using carbide, CCMT cutter. And after I've done this pass, I'll probably come through with a medium pass on it, just to clean it up a bit. Pick all the rubbish off, that's a great job. switch to medium feed. This is where a quick change gearbox is definitely a necessity I reckon. Right. Okay, well I've done about four passes. All the stuff is sitting here or dropped into the tray or a bit gone on the floor. But as you can see, lovely and clean. A few little bits there. I haven't touched this. And the ways have been protected and uh, yeah, this is really, really good. But, uh, and there's nothing down the centre at all virtually. So uh, uh, yeah, anyway, I hope you found it interesting, and uh, well, just another little tip, and uh, yeah, it's a good way to protect your lathe. Okay, see you next time, cheers.